Assalamu alaikum students we are uh, on chapter number 9 in revising it so your today's topic is data transfer media how you can transfer your data there are two types of transferring data through wired media and wireless media so uh, when your uh, internet is wired so your computer is connected is connected to the modem and then your modem is connected to the telephone line and telephone line is connected to the isp now isp means a uh, internet service provider for example ptcl or niatel and this provider will connect your uh, things your or your computer to the internet if your media is wireless then it will be like uh, your desktop will be connected to the um, router through wifi or it can be wired but um, you can use the wifi also then it is connected to the dsl modem and the dsl will be connected to the cable um, phone jack which is connected to the um, actually isp and then it gives you the internet uh, internet or it provides you the internet so what is the internet service provided there are two types of internet service providers it can be dial up as we have learned that before also dial up and broadband the dial up technology is that it is the old technology when you have to enter a specific number to connect your internet um, and it is for only specific time means 1 hour 2 hours or 4 hours or 6 hours it is not permanent it is semi permanent means whenever you just um add, uh, enter that number then you connect uh, to the internet and while you are using the internet you cannot use your telephone line means your telephone will be dead at that time and it is also slow speed is very slow then comes the broadband. Broadband is the uh, technology that uh, gives you high speed internet and it can be wired, wireless or um, mobile broadband. Uh, and when you are using the broadband, your telephone line is not um, at the standby, you can use it. Okay, what is the wired broadband? Wired broadband is connected to the wired, for example, we have learned here. This is the wired broadband. It is it has high speed. It is connected to the your computer is connected to the modem, then to the telephone line, and then to the ISP. Then comes the wireless broadband. It is also a high speed um, internet. It has the Wi um, Wi-Fi facility. You can use it anywhere where this it, it your device catches the signals. Then comes the wireless mobile broadband. It is used through your, you, you know that uh, nowadays U phone, Jazz, Wired, or these all companies give you internet. So that is wireless mobile broadband. And it is used through that dongles. Dongles means the, this is the small USB which contains a sim a data sim which gives you the internet then comes world wide web world wide web means that you can access any type of thing any type of uh, website through your internet browser means all the websites are connected with each other what is the web browser a web browser is a program which uh, gives you the facility to um, search for websites so there are different type of um, web browsers are, are available microsoft internet explorer is the default browser in the windows and you can even um, download any other of these what is a web page a web page is um, a page which contains the uh, different type of images videos audios or text or hyperlinks um, which is is placed on the page and it can it is the part of a website 
okay so what are the hyperlinks a hyperlinks are those type of text when you click on it you first of all you see that type of hand on it when you click on it and other page will be opened what is a website a website is collection of the web pages it it has a similar topic means uh, if a website is on um, um, sports then it contains all most all of the type of the sports in it or different things which are uh, connected to the sports and when you just search the websites and moving from one website to the other website it it is called net surfing your today's task is up, up till here if you um, have any query just ask in the comment